Uh, let me call the meeting to order. Um, so uh, Dan is now recording us uh, as a public meeting. <clears throat> what we will do is that we will uh, lay the ground rules a little bit here to start with. Then <clears throat> we will break into uh, executive session and go through the interviews uh, through executive session. Um, as each of you know, I think by now, uh, at the end of each interview, we drop off or get thrown off, and uh, then we have to reconnect for the second interview and the third. At the end of the third interview, then we will come out of, uh, we will have a brief discussion. We will um, remove the candidate um, that is being interviewed at that time. There will be a discussion between the boards uh, relative, board members relative to what's taken place and thoughts about the position, thoughts about filling it, thoughts about going back to other candidates, whatever you would like to do. And then before the um, meeting would close, we will go back into a public session that will be recorded. So that we do not have to drop off again at the end of the third um, interview, we will ask uh, the candidate to remove himself and um, we can remove him, Mike and Dan can remove him. It's possible for them to dial back in, but if they do, we see them and then we can um, act accordingly. And we've already, Mike and I and Dan have already had that discussion. Um, at the end of the meeting, if it's necessary for us to take action, if we would like to take action, we will go back into public format and Dan will record it at that time. We will not be publicly um, um, broadcast in video format at that point, um, but we will be recorded publicly as we are now <clears throat> for the record. Um, I wanna thank Dan and Mike for all their efforts, especially Dan and communicating to each of us and getting ready for this process um, and his, his team um, that did so. Um, with regards to questions, Brett, <clears throat> I have you and we, I wasn't sure whether you were coming on or not. So I'll have you take question number one and question number, um, we'll wait and see what Ed does. Um, but I'll have you take question number one and question number eight. And then if Ed comes on, he'll take number four. If he doesn't, I will. And then I'll take number 10. And at the end of number 10, we will give the candidates, each of them, an opportunity to make any comments they would like to make and ask us any questions they would like to ask us. It's my goal to be done with this before five o'clock. Uh, so I have advised Dan and Mike of that, that so I don't want you know, large gaps of time between the end, obvious of one meeting and the beginning of the next. And so um, um, we will, at the end of each one, go back into session, except for the last one. And then we'll stay in session and do whatever the board wants to do with regards to that. In a, and then come back into public forum. Does that make any sense? Yep. Sure. Okay, is there anything else anybody would like to raise before we get started? John, this is uh, Mike, and I'd point out we have him on now. We did have one member of the public uh, request information since we talked yesterday. That's Wade Cooper Ryder. He's, he's on now, so I just want to let you know that uh, and, and our first candidate is still sitting in the queue waiting to be admitted. Okay. So we do have one member of the public on right now at this moment. Okay, so um, I will go, um, last I heard we had none. So I would go, um, is there anybody, any member of the public who would like to make a comment now um, because we won't do public comment at the end? Okay, and uh, who is it that's on? Wade Cooper Ryder. Okay, Wade, uh, can you hear me? I, 
maybe. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Were you able to hear what I just said? Yes, sir, I was. Okay, so we'll be going into executive session, so you won't have access to that for the interviews. So if there's anything you'd like to raise now, Wade, please feel free to do that because we do have a public comment period. Yeah, the only thing um, <clears throat> I got on just a couple minutes late, did you announce who the candidates are? The, the, the candidates, uh, we usually don't do that until we come out of it. Um, but the candidates right at this stage in the game, because we will announce it in the end and record it, I don't have any problem doing that. Tyler Thomas, Ethan Wilfor, and Dan Berryman. Okay, thank you. You're very, very welcome. Okay, uh, that being said, let's go into executive session. Dan, please. Okay, you're live. Okay, we're, we're back uh, after the interviews of, uh, of the three parties, the three parties interviewed uh, were Tyler Thomas, Ethan Wilfor, and Don Berryman. They were chosen by the subcommittee uh, of personnel that reviewed all the applicants and recommended these three for interviews. Uh, the condition of the interview we uh, started with was that we would go through the interview of these three individuals. Um, uh, we each have our own individual score sheet and we did that in an executive session. We had uh, one party that, that um, um, had evidently been an applicant and had, had um, received the information that they thought they could sit in for the whole thing. Uh, we informed them that we were going into an executive session, that we would come out of that executive session at a public uh, meeting afterwards. Um, we will be not going forward with any decision or discussion today. We will wait till tomorrow's public meeting uh, in the brand segment. Uh, that's scheduled now for approximately nine o'clock a.m. Uh, during the, the scheduled uh, regular meeting of the Board of Livestock. Um, other than that, uh, is there, I would assume there's no one here uh, now that would like um, any, to make any other public comment. I'll, I'll be quiet for a moment in case there is. Well, you took public comment at the beginning of this meeting uh, and there wasn't any. And I'll ask, is there any public comment now? If not, again, thanks to Dan and his team for putting it all together. And Michael, uh, thanks for your hard work putting this all together. And thanks to all the board members for being here. It's been, been a very interesting experience. So I guess we can all zoom away. Hey, John. Thank you. Yes. Uh, the notes and that kind of stuff, what do we, do we just, Email those to Mike, or what do we do? Either email them or put them in the mail to Mike. Snail mail, either way. They're a record, uh, and we'll, we'll go through that. Well, we don't need to go through it tomorrow, but this record you keep for your discussion tomorrow, and then put them in the mail to Mike. They'll go into a, a personnel file. I'll, I'll scan, my, scan an email mine to Mike tonight. Anything else? Yes, John, I yes. do have one thing. On the page that Mike sent out to us that uh, tells who's gonna do which question, whoever typed that out, I would, I would like them to know that my last name is spelled B-A-U-C-U-S, which is different than the God of wine. <laughs> so you're not you don't own the Bacchus pub? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> well, that's too bad. We could have had a wine and cheese party there. Yeah. We can't okay. gather though. <laughs> Anything else? All right, thank you all. No. Thank you.